Hi guys, it's Denise. It is Monday, January 29th, and I have a Walmart haul for you. I went to Walmart in Gettysburg, Pennsylvania and Westminster, Maryland, and I found great items at both stores. Um, right now, they are just like super, super marking down so many things. Um, I feel like it's been going on for probably the past couple of weeks because I know um, I purchased some today and I purchased some like probably a little over two weeks ago and I cannot wait to show you. I have a little bit of time and um, I want to just go ahead and film this. So I'm going to go ahead and start. So what I've been doing, I've been trying to buy some things to, um, I'm going to wrap and I'm going to give to my family, to my kids uh, as Christmas presents because this past year I didn't do anything like extra and nobody complained about it or anything like that. They probably were happy they didn't get that much extra, but um, I normally buy extra things. And this year I'm doing that. And um, I don't know, I just I just found some pretty, pretty awesome stuff to them. It may not be that awesome, but I don't know. I think they're really good extra gifts. So um, I found the West, the Walmart in Westminster. When I was there today, I don't know how they do this. I feel like I was there a couple of weeks ago things were marked down cheap. I go back today and they're like up in price. So I don't know if I'm seeing things or if they're really doing that, but I, I think, I don't know, I feel like the prices went up. So I don't really care for that. So I found, these are Wonder Nation pajamas, okay? Um, all I found, what, what I was so happy about is normally they have tons and tons of, of girl items, uh, clothes on clearance. And I feel like the boys, they hold on to that stuff forever but I scored. I scored on these. Um, these, these initially sold for $9 and 98 cents. It says $6, but they were three. They were $3 and these are extra, extra large. Um, I think they're even Husky and one of mine is, is a Husky. So these are, these are Christmas presents. These are pajamas they're getting for Christmas next year. And they are long sleeve. They are long pants. And I'm super excited about this. So this one is just a, a dinosaur on a bicycle. And there's a couple of helicopters around him. And it's a glow in the dark. So I grabbed up one. I think I grabbed up two of those. I have the biggest mound on this chair in here. Um, I got my stuff tangled. I have the biggest mound of stuff on this chair in here. So yeah, I grabbed up two of these. So exciting. So if you're a store, you, you go to your store, see if they're clearancing um, these pajamas. Everybody needs pajamas. Even if they don't wear the long, the long sleeve shirt, they can wear the pajama pants. And I feel like that's a, that's a steal. Uh, this one, this is a extra, extra large also. And um, three bucks. It's just a race car, long sleeve and some fleece pants. Super, super nice. They only had one in that pattern. And then this uh, shark, I guess he's like a, he's a shark listening to some music. Same thing, these nice fleece pants, $3 a piece for these sets, sold for 10 bucks. Walmart, Westminster, Maryland. So yeah, I'm, I'm super, super excited about those. And I've been picking up more and more boxes at the Dollar Tree. Um, so I can, you know, so I can wrap, so I can wrap some things. I actually probably should have picked up more during the holidays, like right after the holidays, but I wasn't thinking. I wasn't in this frame of mind yet. So I did get a few, not a ton, not a ton. Um, okay, these are also from Walmart in Westminster. So I have a little grandson and he is 17 months old, 16 months old. Um, and I picked up multiple shirts because these shirts could fit him now. This is 18 months and it's super cute. It's a little monster truck and it's got a snowman in the back and a, a polar bear in the front driving it. Do you see the price on there? 50 cents, 50 cents. This is their Garanimals brand. And this originally sold, which is still not a ton of money, but 50 cents, it's even better, sold for $3.98. So I got him one for now for my house, just to have at my house. Um, and then I actually, I think I got th two more cause they were so cheap. I got a three T 50 cents. And this is all they had left in that, um, 
the, the little Goranimals uh, section, but I did pick up more in Gettysburg. Um, and this one's a 2T. So this one I will probably, he'll probably get for Christmas next year. Or maybe I'll give it to him before because that's so cute. That is a super cute little, I don't know, I feel like it's almost like a little holiday, definitely winter themed shirt, but 50 cents. Go check out the baby stuff at Walmart. I mean, they're basically like giving giving things away. I'm just kidding, but they kind of are. Uh, we have um, a couple friends that we do gift exchanges and things like that. Um, and their children, their birthdays, I think they're both in March. So um, I've been picking up things here or there, here and there for them. Um, I picked up this nightgown for their daughter. It's, uh, it was $4. And this actually regularly sold for $7.48. And it's cute. It just says po positive vibes. And it's got a little, what, are they, what is that, a Boston Terrier on the front with these cute, that's actually really cute for Valentine's Day with those heart glasses. So, so, so soft. So I grabbed her one of those and this cute little robe. This one was $3.50. It's almost like a, it's almost a bathrobe. It's kind of short, but it's got a little belt. I think this one sold, this one sold for $12.98 and I got it for $3.50. I mean, this is even better than Goodwill. Goodwill's prices are just crazy. And our Goodwill out here, I don't know. Um, some of them are really, really good. I know the Eldersburg one is good, but Westminster, I don't like it. Like, I just don't feel like it's got a bad vibe to me. It's got a ba bad vibe and it reeks. And it reeks. So anytime I buy something, I feel like I made a mistake. So I probably shouldn't buy anything there. Probably shouldn't buy anything there. So um, I got her this one. It's so cute. So soft. I wouldn't mind one for myself. And then um, I got her brother these pajamas. And I do have extra things for them also. These pajamas, and this one says, I'm too cool for just one planet. And uh, again, this was $3, let me see here. Yeah, so this one actually says it. Um, so there's a couple markdowns on there. You can't beat that. Again, even if they just wear the pants, it's totally worth it. So I grabbed up all those. Let me see. I also picked up in Westminster, and this was a while back. I got the fleece throws because they're also getting these little um, throws, 75 cents, 75 cents. She's getting the little doggy one. And then I bought a ton of these. I mean, girls, guys, anybody, like this is a great add-on gift. Uh, save it for next year, save it for whenever. If you're having a, um, a for my daughter, my son and daughter-in-law's rehearsal dinner, we had it outside at my parents' house and I had a bunch of throws. Um, in a in a basket and it I kept, oh my god what did it say to have and to hold in case you get cold that's what it said I saw this on Pinterest or something and I had a little tag on these that it and it said that so if you find these if you're having a party if you're anything these are great favors these are great favors for um for a party so 75 cents and I think these initially sold for five dollars I want to say these were five bucks so this is this one. I actually really really like this pattern, but um, she's gonna love she's gonna love a little doggy one. So I grabbed up those. Hopefully I don't have anything under. I feel like I'm piling all my stuff on this bag here. No, that's good. And that's good. So let me see. Let me see what's next. Um, let me grab these from down here. Again, these are all from what I'm showing you right now. Are all from the Westminster Maryland store. Okay, this. Super surprise, super surprise at the price. Where's the other one? I have a, oh, there it is, it's hiding from me. So these are packs of men's crew socks. Okay, I got one, two, three, four, five. And there's three in a pack. Are you guys ready for this? Are you ready to see how much I paid? 99 cents. I'm splitting these up. I am splitting these up and giving them uh, for Christmas to to the guys this year. I mean, I've got lots of, we have lots of guys in our family and um, everybody needs socks. And I feel like everybody, I, I don't know, these, these are super cool. So this, are, this is Nickelodeon SpongeBob SquarePants men's pair, men's three pair crew socks. Again, 99 cents, cheaper than the Dollar Tree. I uh, got that one. And there, I did leave some behind, uh, but uh, I think I was just at the right place at the right time. This is also, uh, they're all just men's crew socks. 
So this one is from Christmas Vacation. You can see that. I'm gonna show you the back of the sock. So that's what they look like on the back. Let me show you the SpongeBob ones. They have a picture, it's on the side. So there's those. They're cute, they are cute. And that is a ton, that is a ton of socks. This one is just Waffle House. So um, that's what it looks like. And then that's what the socks look like on the back. Again, steel. I'm gonna start wrapping on Wednesday. I'm not really, I mean, I go to work tomorrow, um, but Wednesday I'm gonna be home. So I feel like I'm gonna do, I'm gonna wrap these, I'm gonna make a list, I'm gonna wrap these and hopefully not lose them. I have a specific spot where they're going to be and, um, and that's that. The spam, so funny, so cute. And on the back, that's what it looks like. You know, spam's not terrible. If you're desperate, if you're desperate, it's, it's all right. We actually, uh, we have like, we buy extra food. So we, if in case anything were to happen, we will, you know, we have survival food. Um, and spam was one of those. And sometimes I'm like, I've been to the store, which is not that often. I'll break out the spam and, and I'll cook it. Uh, this one's pretty cool. This one is um, a nightmare on Elm Street. And it just has that, uh, it says horror on it. And on the back, it's pretty, it's pretty cool. It's got... Freddy Krueger, uh, was it Jason, and that clown, at it clown. So I got those. So what is that? One, two, three, four, five. 12, 16. Is that 16? Yeah, 16 pairs of socks. That's awesome. That is so awesome. So I was really, really, really excited to find those. Um, I picked up this shirt and I don't know, I'm, I'm not, might give it to my oldest son or I might keep it for myself just to like wear it to bed. This is one of those, it's just a Smurfs t-shirt. It says the Smurfs, it's a large. And um, it sold rightly for $8.98 and look what I paid for it, 50 cents. I was hoping to find more but I didn't, so that's fine. That is fine. Um, I'm gonna give these to the boys now. These aren't like Christmas presents. These are just Wonder Nation t-shirts. Um, and these sold initially, this isn't a huge deal, but these sold initially for $3.98 and they were $2. I just liked this color, this blue. It's almost like a grayish, um, it's like a military blue, isn't it? Williamsburg blue maybe. And I grabbed up two of those. And I think, I think that's it. Wait a second, for my Westminster, for my Westminster store. Okay, so I also picked up, and this one is Gettysburg, okay? These are just some sweat, sweatpants. Um, this brand is Athletic Works by Walmart. Uh, it says Athletic Works Fleece Bottoms, and these are just a black pair. And they are extra, extra large. And these initially sold for $6.98. And I got them for four bucks. Four dollars. I think that's a steal. I think that's a steal. And again, Gettysburg was just like overflowing. Even at Walmart, I felt like, why do they have so much stuff? Why is this store overflowing with stuff? And why, are, why isn't it all marked down? Why isn't it all mark, marked down? Um, then I also got, so I think, I don't know if these are, these aren't Husky, but that's okay because they're actually, um, they're sweatpants and, and like Wyatt is, he's getting a little bit taller, but he, um, he's a big, he's a big guy and these, these will fit him. Both of them actually fit them well next year. So I really like this like tan, like tan color. I actually got the full sweatsuit of these. So I got the top for $4 and I got these bottoms for $4. And I think this would just look really nice, um, even with like a little flannel shirt over top of it and some cute tennis shoes. Uh, again, this was eight bucks for this entire outfit. And really, um, I think all together it would have been probably what, $14, something like that. Yeah, because they're both $6.98 each. And I got them both these. And my husband doesn't always love it when I buy him the same thing, but they have to have their own clothes, even if, even, even if they're the same. 
Okay, so this right here, I feel like this was one of my huge, huge scores. Uh, they both are already wearing a jacket. I may um, give them two next year, I'm not sure, or just hold on to them for next fall. So my grandson is, he'll be two this summer, two in August. And um, of course, this is gonna be way too big for him, but when I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, this is their style, this is so nice. And uh, this is just a little fleece, a little fleece zip up jacket. Super, super cute. Uh, it's sold for $9.98 and I got it for two bucks. Two dollars. And I'm gonna give it to him for Christmas. And you know what, they can put this in his little closet and maybe by kindergarten, <laughs> it'll fit him. He got a jacket. He's already got a jacket waiting for him. He's got a jacket waiting for him for kindergarten. And then I bought, I've got a black one, and I think Jesse is wearing that one today. And look at this, two bucks. These are super nice, super, super nice um, fleece zip up jacket. There is no hood and they're fine with that. So I got this nice blue one. I got a black one that Jesse is wearing. And then I got this camo one. And I think I'm gonna give Wyatt the camo one and I'll give Jesse the blue one. Um, so even if you're donating, if you wanna give some something to your church, anything like that, go to Walmart and just see if they still have anything or just see if they're getting ready to mark things down a little bit more because they really should be. Again, both stores were overflowing, overflowing with items. And I was there for it to um, help them get rid of it. So be on the lookout for these. This was a great deal. They sold for $9.98 and I got them all for $2 each. So there's that. And then I got... I think the tag was ripped off of this. Yes, it was. These are just pajama pants. Okay, so when I was at Walmart today, these pajama pants were not marked down. They weren't marked down to, well, I guess they were marked down. They just weren't marked down to the price that I paid for them. So these are, what is that? What is that? Um, well, it's a Walmart brand. I'm trying to think, what is that? George. Oh. Somebody's picking something up out front, so my dog's barking like crazy. So it is the George brand, okay? These are just pajama, lightweight gray pajama pants. I got a couple in black also. These sold, these sold for, where's that tag? One has it and one doesn't. These sold for $10, oh, it's right here, for $10.48. I paid two bucks. I paid two dollars for these so i got them for all the guys all the big guys i think i did get jesse a pair because he's a little bit taller but um it may not work out for him so that to me is a huge huge steal these could be everyday pants if they really want if they really wanted they have pockets it does say i think it does say pajama pant comfort waistband solid knit i don't know let me look on this one it really doesn't matter. It, yeah, it's a sleep pant. But these can be worn as an everyday, like a sweat pant with a sweatshirt. They're super thin. Uh, I don't love big, thick fleece uh, pants because it makes me hot and that makes me not happy. So um, super thin. These were marked down to six bucks at the Walmart in Westminster. So $2, I mean, come on now. Come on now. So again, I grabbed one two, three, four, five, six. I grabbed up six pair. I was so, I just kept going by there. I was like, do, do they have anything else in there? <laughs> do they have anything else in there? I also picked up, I don't know how this will work out. If not, I, I mean, I can give it to somebody else. Um, I don't actually know the size of this. Does it say? I don't know, but I got this two piece zip tie and pocket square sold for $5.98 and I got it for a dollar. I got it for a dollar. It's really cute. Um, oh, it goes around the neck like that. Very cute. I don't know if that would fit my boys. I'm not sure or if it would fit my little grandson. And then um, I found these, the little suspenders and the bow tie. 
it says ages three and up, but I don't really know what that means. Um, the bow tie possibly could could fit uh, Jesse. I don't know if is that still in when when guys dress up? Are they still wearing bow ties? I don't know. Um, so I don't know. The suspenders also are awesome because we've got some snow pants that um, don't stay up. So we rig them with uh, some suspenders. And I actually the green suspenders I got from the Dollar Tree when um, it was St. Patrick's Day. So a dollar, a dollar each. Again, Walmart, Westminster does not have these marked down to a dollar. So whatever your good store is that you are have good luck at, go to it and grab up what they got. Okay, I did leave his, uh, my grandson's other shirts upstairs that I got him. I got him a couple cute sweatshirts, uh, but I picked up a whole bunch of pants for that child because you know what? That store, the Walmart always has, they, these are something they sell every single year, okay? They still sell these Garanimal pants every year. So at first I was like, oh, I'm just gonna get what he, what he wears. But then I thought, you know what? No, I will probably be buying these in next year, the year after that. So I grabbed up, I guess what I, what I wanted, there was still lots of them there. Some lady had a, she had a, a cart mound, a huge mound on her cart buying stuff and I was like you go girl that I, that I mean we could totally hang but I feel like I don't I don't know we'd be in like I don't want to say competition because I want my stuff and she wants her stuff you know so maybe we were appreciating appreciating each other from afar so I picked up one two three four five and I think I have six seven eight I think I have three more upstairs so this is just the Garanimal um pants okay and I paid these were regularly, they sold for $5.98. And for a dollar, one dollar. So I got this black pair. The other two that I have upstairs are more like joggers and they're smaller, so they're for him now. Um, this one is another, this is a 3T and this is the gray pair and one buck, one dollar. This one, this is a 4T, so I'm saying this will be kindergarten. This will be kindergarten. And um, again, $1. This is the navy blue, so nice. And these are good, you know? Again, if they get messed up, you pitch them. You pitch them. So super, super deal for $1. I guess they, again, they were marked down to four at one time. And then this lady, she came walking by and found them for a dollar. And then one more pair of gray. I mean, I could have some at my house, she could have some at her house, or I'll just give her, I'll just give them all to them. One dollar. So to me, when I find that kind of stuff, I'm just, it makes me so, so happy. And then I found this, I found, I got one for um, my friend's daughter. This is just a three pack and it says zipper bags and it's pen plus gear but I would use it for other things and I got this three pack for a dollar. And I thought that was a really good, a really good deal. Um, you can use it for lots and lots of different things. Uh, I'm probably gonna use it in my purse. And then I found these cute folders for myself. And this is a nine count of file folders. And this was also a dollar. So um, I got this for, for us. So nine for a dollar, I thought that was a steal. So guys, that's it. That's it. It's a lot of stuff. I'm super excited. I'm going to start wrapping these things on Wednesday. I actually went to the Dollar Tree, so I was able to find some, some good items at my Dollar Tree. And I'm going to probably show you that maybe on Friday. I don't usually do a Monday haul, but I really wanted to record my Walmart haul and get this stuff in, um, in order somewhere. So, so I hope you liked it. I hope you go to your store and I hope you find deals because they are there and they are waiting for you. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. My name is Denise. This is Denise's Halls. I go to the Dollar Tree. I go to Walmart. I go to the grocery outlet and um, I just love to show you. I love telling everybody about my deals and I just want everyone um, to find them. I want everyone to go out and look for themselves and, and get some bargains because right now everything is really expensive. So I was so happy to see old school, old school discounted prices at my Walmarts because I feel like they just haven't, they just haven't been doing it. So I, I hope 
you find um, lots and lots of good stuff and put it away. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm putting this away. I am wrapping it up. I know it's, I mean, we just got over Christmas, but I feel like I need, I need to do that. I need to get a, a huge jump start. And if I don't do anything else, if I don't find anything else, that's fine. I already have this. So I have some extra gifts for them to open and then to have, and they're all useful things. It's not junk. This is all awesome stuff. So again, go to your store, find those deals, find those deals, buy them up, save them for Christmas, save them for birthdays, whatever. It is a huge, huge help. So again, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you have not yet subscribed, please do. I would love to have you. And um, that's it. So thank you so much. So have a great day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.